April 21st of 2006. Uh, she, she knew something wasn't quite right and uh, had discovered a, uh, a kind of a lump on her abdomen, uh, a pie on her abdomen, went to her family doctor and he thought possibly she had a high hernia, sent her to a general surgeon. He uh, did a, a CAT scan and examined her and determined that uh, he thought that this could be ovarian cancer. And uh, that day referred her to Dr. Kelly Manahan. Um, the following Monday, we were in Dr. Manahan's office that morning and confirmed uh, that Jane had stage 3C ovarian cancer. Kelly uh, talked about our options, um, discussed what she thought would be the best course of action, which was uh, immediate uh, radical surgery, uh, complete hysterectomy and, and the uh, removal of all tumorous growths. Jane didn't bat an eye. She forged right into that recommendation. She had probably had the disease for six months until she was diagnosed, which is one of the major problems that, that we have here. There is no early warning uh, testing that's accurate, and the symptoms all mimic uh, things that generally menopausal women are going through. So during that uh, time period that Jane uh, fought this disease and she and I together fought this disease. Uh, it's about a two-year period where she again had to go through a major surgery to remove tumors, a couple of minor surgeries, uh, several rounds of chemotherapy. This year uh, we would have been married 13 years but this will be her second anniversary of her rebirth day uh, since we lost her to heaven. There tends to be patients that when they're going through the treatment for ovarian cancer they kind of fall into two camps. Those who are extremely private about it and uh, really don't want to uh, and want to keep it private and those who want to shout it to the rooftops and, and tell everyone else what's happening to them and uh, in an effort to try to help someone else. Uh, Jane fell into that latter camp. Uh, naturally so. In every situation that she she could that people would know about this and know what it was about and uh, spread that word.